This, if you're a fan like me, you'll agree that It Ain't Half Hot Mom is among the best sitcoms ever. So do you want to join me today? Grab a chair, sit by the campfire, and we'll live this great show together. We'll travel through the entire cast, past and present, reminiscing about those who have left us and celebrating those who still shine. Are you ready? Let's dive in and rekindle some incredible memories. Stewart McGugan played the character Gunnar Atlas McIntosh in the sitcom when he was 30 years old in 1974. See, at the age of 79, he's living a fulfilling life with a passion right here in Stirling Shire, Scotland. This is unprofessional. What do you think, Lofty? You haven't said much. He never does. Well, he's a nice boy. Run by the BBC. Uh, with a restaurant on the top, administration on the ground floor, and the other, all the other floors were rehearsal rooms. So, Windsor Davies played the character Battery Surgeon Major Tudor Bryn Williams in the sitcom when he was 44 in 1974. Sadly, on January 17, 2019, he left us of natural causes at 88 in Friends. We are deeply saddened by his passing. <laughs> Willingly, sir, you are too kind. <laughs> Oh, Mr. Lardy Dargun Graham. What? I'm done. No. Peeled. Peeled. I never harmed him. Cried. I never peeled. I never harmed him. 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 Bert Quirk played the character Me Then in the sitcom when he was 47 in 1977. Sadly, on May 24th, 2016, he left us due to cancer at 85 in Hampstead, London, England. We are deeply saddened by his passing. <laughs> you very flat lady who dress as soldier. <laughs> also need the shave. No, you got it the wrong way around, you see. Son of yours is in a film. And my, my mother didn't believe him. So she had to be dragged to go and see the film. And she said. Melvin Hayes played the character Bombardier Beaumont in the sitcom when he was 39 in 1974. See, at the age of 89. He's living a fulfilling life with a passion right here in London, England. It's too far this time. He's upset me with all that talk about jungles. <laughs> I mean, I mean, am I expected to do a show tonight after all that chat? Yeah. It's a London double-decker bus, and it's about the width of two of them would make the size of the road. There's a sheer drop, thousands of feet, and the wall of the thing. He said, I want you to drive it round. Michael Knowles played the character Captain Jonathan Ashwood in the sitcom when he was 37 in 1974. See, at 86 years old, he is living a fulfilling life with a passion right here in Derbyshire, England. <laughs> and what was your favourite episode in uh, Your Anger Lord? Oh, crumbs. Uh, let me think. Favourite episode. Bite, bite it out. Donald Hewlett played the character Colonel Charles Reynolds in the sitcom when he was 54 in 1974. Sadly, on June 4th, 2011, he left us due to cancer at 90 years old in Chelsea, London, England. We are deeply saddened by his passing. Where are the officers' quarters? We don't have officers' quarters in Plains, Ashwood. You just sit down. What about you, sir? I shall sit with the driver. <laughs> Dino Shafiq played the character Shawala Muhammad in the sitcom when he was 44 in 1974. Sadly, on March 10, 1984, he left us due to a heart attack at 53 in London, England. We are deeply saddened by his passing. At the concert party, pull down the onion jack. Oh, <laughs> this will mean many bags of bull. Christopher Mitchell played the character Gunnar Parkin in the sitcom when he was 26 in 1974. Sadly, on February 22, 2001, he left us due to cancer at 52 in Kings Lynn, Norfolk, England. We are deeply saddened by his passing. Shoulders back in a parking. Stand up straight. Fine pair of shoulders you got there, boy. Don Estelle played the character Gunnar Sutton in the sitcom when he was 41 in 1974. 
Sadly, on August 2, 2003, he left us due to a stroke at the age of 70 in Rochdale, Greater Manchester, England. We are deeply saddened by his passing. Sally, is there something important? Blimey! Here, Sergeant Major, look what Lofty found. Well Kenneth MacDonald played the character Gunnar Clark in the sitcom when he was 24 in 1974. Sadly, on August 6, 2001, he left us of a heart attack at 50 years old. In Hawaii, USA, we are deeply saddened by his passing. You married Mohammed. I have three wives. <laughs> well, doesn't that make life a bit complicated? No, sir. Muslim law is very strict. I have... Aishak Bucks played the character fortune-telling Walla in the sitcom when he was 57 in 1974. Sadly, on September 2, 2000, he left us due to terminal lung cancer at 83 in London, England. We are deeply saddened by his passing. It's out of my pasha. They're not yours, they're ours. And where is Captain Bishop? I'm not telling you, soldier boy, damn nothing. What? How dare you talk to Colonel Saab like that? John Clegg played the character Gunnar Graham in the sitcom when he was 40 years old in 1974. See, at 89 years old, he is living a fulfilling life for the passion right here in Moray, British India. Local army. Honestly, you think they'd have enough sense to extend the pipe so the tap was over the basins, wouldn't you? They've already tried that, sir. Huh? But water not strong enough to make journey, sir. Michael Bates played the character Ranky Ram in the sitcom when he was 54 in 1974. Sadly, on January 11, 1978, he left us due to cancer at 57 in Chelsea, London, England. We are deeply saddened by his passing. I very much doubt it. Sir, <coughs> this is man, and this is woman, and they are strolling through the enchanted forest. Okay, let's chat. Who is your favorite character in it Eng Hafat Mom? Please comment and share interesting things below this video. And as always, show some love. Hit the like button, subscribe to know more, and hit the bell to never miss my new content. I can't wait to create more wonderful memories with you. Thanks so much and stay tuned for more. See you again as soon as possible.